This witch is one of those products that intrigues me. Not, it's not something that I would have normally purchased, but I saw it at the Home Goods store last year after Halloween. It kept getting marked down as the time passed until it was about $30 marked down from, I believe it was $180. Um, so I thought I would just go ahead and pick it up because um, I do love a bargain. But I really don't know much about this witch. She stands about five feet tall, so she's pretty big, made of a resin. Um, there's a tag on here that says spooked, which is a trademark, but I couldn't really find anything about them when I looked them up online. It just says LED lighted decor. There's no other indication on here um, about what she might be, but again, I thought she was pretty cool. Um, she is an LED product. The battery was of course dead like they usually are when I get them. Um, so I thought we would go ahead together and try and see what happens when we um, get her get her going. There is a battery compartment on the back, some sort of um, light sensor up at the top. Just for convenience, I went ahead and removed three of the four screws. If you've watched any of my videos, you'll know I hate these things. They're the bane of my Halloween existence. But I've gone ahead and removed the last screw there, the compartment. Um, looks like there's another little rubber cover piece. I guess that's so it you know, can go outside. Um, there is one battery in here. It looks like it is a rechargeable battery, so I'm not sure why it's not working. But let's go ahead and swap that out with one of my Duracells here and see what happens. All right. There is a switch here. I think the compartment says on. So we put it on the. All right, we switched it on. Let's go ahead and put the cover back on. I guess we can probably leave it off for now. Turn it around. Oh, it is very, very heavy. All right, well, nothing's happening. Let's see if we cover the sensor. There we go. She lights up. I'm not sure how well that's going to show up on the camera. I'll turn the lights off here at the end, but um, you know, for 30 bucks, she's pretty cool. Nice little garden statue. I'll probably use her in my foyer with my witch um, decor. I think she's she's fun. Let's call her Zelda. <laughs> so anyway, um, this was just a quick prop showcase. If you want to see more of the props that I bought last year, more product reviews, DIYs, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you around. Happy haunting.